Welcome to Andrew Says, everybody. A couple weeks ago, I asked a simple question to people on YouTube. Will the border wall get built? And there's one very obvious answer, one clear winner, and that is people hate YouTube polls. Just kidding. Obviously, this is a very scientific poll we have here. Will the wall get built? Yes, build that wall 54%. No, it won't. 11. Don't agree with Trump, but we need the wall 6. No wall, I'm against it. 8%, and I don't care, but I think the wall gets built at a whopping 22%. So if we tally up the yes and the no through the few options, we basically got a 60-40 split in favor of building the wall, whether you like Trump or agree with him on other stuff or not. Remember, very scientific poll. So let's take a look at some of the top comments to see what you people were thinking. 52% of your followers are racist. Very cool Hollywood Dash, very edgy. I am in your debt for that one. Chose the one that says I don't care because honestly it's just a distraction. The more we talk about something that may or may not work, in whatever context, the symbol of the meaning, the funds of it, who's paying what not, we are talking about bump stocks, snap benefits, where the homeless are going, China, Russia, Fukushima, the cleanse, the bushes, why gas is so cheap, the exhaust law in Cali, Opinion is like a blah 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 and a blah 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 tra la la. I think I get your point there. I know there are things we could always be talking about, but there are some things that we do need to talk about. So let's just get this done and over with and uh, go on to more important matters. As far as bump stocks, I'm pretty sure they're illegal. If I can get a fact check on that one. And China and Russia, I think people really, really talk about China, Russia a lot, especially when it comes to the economy in terms of China. And talk about the Clintons. No way. That's racist. The people in the comments have got to be kidding me. Spending so much money on a damn wall that don't, won't do anything. People have ladders and boats can swim. Like, wow, y'all blind and brainwashed Republicans have to be joking. Many don't have jobs and are getting pay aren't getting paid for a wall that won't do anything. This is all pathetic. So, since people have boats and ladders, just no border, I guess. Just, just open it up. And also, the $11 billion for the wall that they're asking for is actually pennies in comparison to the entire budget. Even CNN thinks so. The $5 billion that could spark a partial shutdown is a very small part of the federal budget, says CNN. They even did a fancy graphic that shows uh, the federal budget at $4.4 trillion. $5 billion is a very tiny portion of it. Now, they're going with $5 billion there. I go with the $11.5 billion that I think they asked for. So, But still, compared to trillions of dollars, it's really not that much and not worth shutting the government down for. Another reply I would have to this comment is... People know how to pick locks, so why lock your door? It's the same logic. You have people that you are trying to keep out of somewhere, so instead of just saying like, well, nothing's going to stop them, just let them in, you still do things to try to prevent even greater number of people from doing so. You dumb butts are so uneducated. If I say immigrants, the first people think is Mexicans when there's actually more Irish immigrants than there are Mexicans. This immigration issue will never end, even if we build a wall. So in reality, there is not more Irish immigrants, as I pointed out here. And that's not to be confused with people who claim to be of Irish heritage. That doesn't make them an immigrant. So I'm not sure exactly what the point is here. I'm not sure why this person thought this was true. But I am the stupidest one, so don't even worry about it. <laughs> the door already is closed. Hit or miss. Oh, no. Hit or miss. I guess they never miss, huh? You got a boyfriend. I bet he doesn't kiss ya. Definitely next. <laughs> Speaking for moderate leading right, I believe the country needs stronger border security, but should go about it in a different way. Yes, the wall might prevent people from coming through, but haven't we found illegal aliens using elaborate tunnel systems to get around the border? So I don't really understand these arguments. Uh, yes, of course, there are other ways people get through the border, but what would you say is easier to stop? A hundred people running at a wall or a hundred people running through an open field? So I don't understand where this comes from, where it's just like there are other ways to get in, but let's just let it happen. And, and this stuff isn't new, and you hear people say that the mainstream media is able to convince people to reject reality that they're seeing. They've managed to get people to reject the fact that barriers prevent people from getting in different places. It really amazes me. Apparently the wall will be made out of solid steel, or at least steel plates with a vacuum in between. They will probably blowtorch through it? <laughs> I'm sorry, the image of a person with like a welding mask uh, firing up their their torch at the border and just sitting there torching it open that just makes me laugh so much all right just 10 more minutes guys i gotta replace my flint i don't know why they had a southern accent <laughs> take shop class and the top comment was illegal immigrants illegal immigrants is like the liberals skip past the illegal part and jump on the trump's racist bandwagon yes the media does love saying all immigrants or anybody speaking about 
every single type of immigrant and not illegal immigrants, which of course is the focus. You need immigrants, uh, skilled immigrants specifically, to continue to go with the economy. I've never heard anyone say, let's stop all immigration. I do think people, when they're trying to say that, when they purposely try to conflate things like that, it's because it's much easier than having an actual opinion. It's much easier to label people as anti-immigrant or something, something where they're blanketed as hateful, so it's okay to dismiss that person's viewpoints. Let me know what you think in the comments. Should there be a wall, or am I just a lunatic? Remember, I wouldn't lie to you, except for maybe this once. And while we're in space, shout out to UFO Jesus, am I right? Here is me engaging in some of my martial practice, which has cultivated within me the strength of a thousand warriors.